a story that's sure to grab your attention. St. Louis County Police say last week, two teens at Hazelwood Central High School allegedly had sex in the middle of a classroom. Fox 2's Max Deeknight went to the district's Board of Education forum tonight, and he has reaction from the community. Parents here in the Hazelwood School District say they are upset tonight. I talked to one off camera who says he wants to know when things like this happen inside of his 15 year old daughter's school. It's something board members were forced to address tonight. St. Louis County Police say it happened a week ago last Thursday morning at Hazelwood Central. They say their officers responded to the school after school officials called police and said they caught two students having sex in a classroom. It apparently happened around 930 in the morning. Police say an 18 year old female student and 17 year old male student are accused of having sex in front of their other students and a teacher in the classroom. Board members addressed two questions that raise concerns over how the district tells parents about incidents like these. We are limiting talking about certain situations to the people that need to know. And, and, and please, 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 because if it was your child and if it was an embarrassing incident, you wouldn't want us talking about it. You just wouldn't. Another board member weighed in with a passionate plea. I have a heavy heart because our kids came to school focused on something else other than their education. It's our problem in the building and in the district. But it's our problem as a community. Last Friday, police told us they were looking to charge that 18 year old female student with first degree sexual misconduct. The 17 year old was referred to family court with the same charge. We do not know the 18 year old student's name. I checked in with the St. Louis County Prosecutor's Office today. Charges have not been filed against that 18 year old student just yet. We'll let you know, though, if anything changes. In Florissant, Max Deeknight, Fox 2 News.